Welcome to Tullahoma High School and tonight's broadcast of Tullahoma High School basketball. Welcome to the Light Tube Sports Network. I'm Scott Shastine, and tonight we've got a good one for you. District 8 AAA opener for both Tullahoma and visiting Marshall County. Let's meet the starting lineup for the Marshall County Tigerettes. Number one, Mashona Ridley. Number 11 is Demaya Blackman. Number 24, Maggie Steely. Number 33, uh, Adriana White. And number 35 is Jekyll Ridley. The Marshall County Tigerettes are coached by David Steely. They are 11 and one on the season. And now the starting lineup for your Tullahoma Lady Cats. Number three, Aubrey North, sophomore guard. Number 20, Isabella Lidstrom, junior guard. She kind of plays the wing position. Number 22, sophomore McLean Bobo, point guard, Tullahoma's leading scorer. Number 23 is Faith Vincent, freshman guard. And number 24 is Lily Melton, senior forward. I think I saw where Lily had 17 Saturday against Moore County. Uh, so Nija, Nija Gibbs, senior forward, out with an injury. And Tullahoma's tabbed Faith Vincent, freshman, to replace her in the starting lineup. So be interesting to see how head coach Chad Hibden's crew does. Tonight, the Lady Cats are 6-9 and nine on the season. Their last game on Saturday, a 43-35 loss to Moore County. Again, this is the District 8 AAA opener for both teams, for everybody tonight. Everybody opens district play tonight. Tullahoma in the white, Marshall County in the blue, and Tullahoma moving right to left as we begin. The Tigerettes have the basketball. Clay Turner, our producer, camera operator, audio engineer tonight. I'm Scott Shastine, and we are glad you're here as we kick off 2024 Light Tube broadcast season. No better place to be than the Cat Palace. North out front for the Lady Cats. Lidstrom on the right wing. Out front to Bobo. Melton makes a move, pulls up from 12 feet away, no good. Rebound, push in the back, that's over the back against Marshall County's Mashana Ridley. First foul on the Tigerettes, first foul on Ridley. Or they call it actually on Blackman, number 11. That's interesting. Either way, Marshall County picks up the foul, Telehoma with possession. All the folks at Light Tube hope you and yours had a nice Christmas and New Year and ready to crush 2024. Melton makes a move in the paint, gets all the way to the backboard, layup no good, but she's fouled. Lily will shoot too. That's the second foul on Blackman, second team foul on Marshall County. They're going to judge she was not in the act of shooting. Looked like a drive to the basket to me. But Tullahoma will inbound on the baseline. North to Bobo. So North running at point guard tonight. Trying to get inside to Lidstrom. She's got a height advantage, but... Uh, they're bringing the double team every time they look her way. So Tullahoma will have to make adjustments as this Moore County defense, a Moore County, Marshall County defense. Melton's three, no good, but North with the rebound. Now Bobo for three, no good. Rebound, Tigerettes. Tigerettes. 
Marshall County works the perimeter. Now three-point try. In and out. Tough break for Ridley. Lidstrom gets the rebound for the Lady Cats. Now here's Isabella, top of the key. And North is called for palming. You don't get many of those anymore in basketball. So usually if they call that early, they'll call it all the way. Marshall County got away with a walk right there. Passed up a eight foot shot in the lane. Now back out front, the Tigerettes set the offense. Tullahoma man to man. Or girl to girl, if you prefer. Slapped away by Vincent, saved by Marshall County layup, good. Tigerettes on the scoreboard with 4.52 left to go in the first quarter. Tullahoma has not scored. Melton pulls up from the free throw line and sinks it, and we're tied. Soft touch from Lily Melton. Tullahoma extends that defense. The Lady Cats are pesky, slapping at the ball. North smacks it away, saved by Ridley. Ridley, a little crossover, drive in, shot no good. A foul on the floor before the shot. So not a bad foul by Tullahoma at all because that was a sure layup. Foul is on North, her first, first team foul. Marshall County baseline. Good pass, shot slapped away by North. I think she just picked up her second foul. Yep. So North gets two quick ones. And at the free throw line is Mashana Ridley. Ridley will shoot two. Neither one good. Rebound Lidstrom for the Lady Cats. Bobo works out front. Vincent. Melton drives in, tries to get it to Vincent, but there's a foul on the floor. Third team foul on Marshall County. First personal foul on Adriana White. Good pass to Melton. Short on the three-point try. Ridley will walk it down court for the Tigerettes. Wide open, got to take it. Ridley can't connect. Rebound Lidstrom. Isabella with a couple. In for Tullahoma's Brindley Duncan, number 11, freshman guard. Bobo, drive, wouldn't fall. McLean will shoot two. So Tullahoma playing multiple freshmen here. As uh, Vincent got the start, and now Brindley Duncan, Duncan in for the Lady Cats. Free throw by Bobo is up, no good. Got to make those freebies at home. Second one in and out. Slapped away by Bobo. Great defensive play. 
save, but Marshall County recovers it. And they walked. So turnover, Tigerettes. 2.41 to go, first quarter. We're tied at two. I'd say it's a low scoring affair. Three second call. So we've had a palming and a three second call, both in the first quarter. That's unusual. North back in with two fouls. Telahoma, a little three quarter court pressure. Marshall County walk, no call. Now Ridley will set the offense. Telahoma sets up in looks, what looks like a 3-2 zone. Melton or Lidstrom tried to knock it away and did, but in the process committed her first personal foul. Three team fouls on Telahoma. Marshall County traveled again. So we're not getting fouls, but we're getting turnovers. Kind of unforced turnovers. North hands it off to Melton. Melton open for three. No good. Rebound yanked away by Marshall County. Ridley, been the primary ball handler tonight. One ten left to go, first quarter. Off the back of the iron, rebound Melton. In the corner, Vincent, travel. You're going to call that close when you take that little step, start your dribble. That far side referee's calling it close. Telehome again with pressure. They'll stretch the Marshall County offense out. Kick for three. Shot partially rejected by Bobo, saved by Melton Lidstrom to Bobo. McLean tripped up from behind. North saves the ball for Telahoma. Here's Melton again for three. Bottom. Count that three-pointer. The foul was underneath, not on Melton. But Melton sinks her second three-pointer. Our second three-pointer. Her first three-pointer. And the foul on Marshall County is on Ridley, her first. It's five team fouls on the Tigerettes. Tullahoma in the bonus the rest of the quarter, which only has 31 seconds remaining. And now they've judged. I don't understand. Melton hit the three. Melton hit a three. Marshall County coach is going nuts. I don't blame him. Melton hit the three. She wasn't fouled. The foul took place underneath the basket. That should be a possession foul, not a shooting foul. Although it is the fifth team foul, so whoever got fouled needs to shoot two. Tullahoma with a chance to have a five-point play. I think it was Lidstrom that got fouled. But that's the fifth team foul. So that's two free throws. And now it is going to be Emily Sharan 
Number 34, Sharan, a senior, who will shoot the free throws. So it was not Lidstrom, it was Sharan. Free throws good. So they were going to give Melton the free throws. Instead, Sharan tickles the twine. 31 seconds to go. Tullahoma up by five. Little pressure. Slow down Marshall County. Layup off the glass. No good. Rebound Lidstrom. Tullahoma with 20 seconds to go. Plenty of time. Don't rush it. Use all the clock. 10 seconds left. Bobo thought about a three. Now looks for Melton. Melton, Bobo. Throws it up there. It's no good, and the first quarter is over. After one, Tullahoma leads Marshall County 7-2 on the Light Tube Sports Network. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage and whole home DVR. Call TUA customer service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Tullahoma holds Marshall County to two points in the first quarter. And the Lady Cats lead the Tigerettes by a score of seven to two. We begin the second quarter. Tullahoma will have possession. Bobo sets the action for the Lady Cats. Get a foul down low. Offensive foul on Lidstrom. I think that is Isabella's second first team foul on Tullahoma here early in the second quarter. Lady Cats have put on some pressure tonight. Almost got the steal, but uh, you can't run through the player to get it. So that's on Lidstrom. And Isabella now with three fouls. She'll probably sit down, yeah. Here comes Faith Vincent back in for Tullahoma. Tullahoma has Vincent, Brindley, Melton, Sharan, and Bobo on the floor. Bobo with the rebound. McLean works it to Brindley for three. No good. Rebound Marshall County. Duncan had a good look. Just wouldn't fall. Travel Marshall County. That one was easy to spot. 24. Maggie Steely, the coach's daughter, has the uh, Multiple traveling violations here early. A minute into the second quarter. Tullahoma still up 7-2. Marshall County team just unable to score. It's not like Tullahoma's burning the nets. Bobo resets, no shot clock in high school basketball, which I believe is a problem. For three, in and out. Sharan just could not get it to fall. Boy, that was halfway down.
Marshall County not showing any post game whatsoever. And as soon as I say that, they throw it into the post, but uh, nice defense by Lily Melton. Here come the Lady Cats. Melton, little crossover. Melton, left side to Bobo. Kick out, wide open three, bottom. Melton has her second three of the half. Tullahoma leads 10-2, 5.40 to go in the half. Looked to me like Marshall County got away with a carry there, but uh, Demaya Blackman scores. Where has that been? Freshman to freshman. Now to Bobo. Bobo being harassed out there by Ridley. Ridley talking a little. That clapping going on defense. That means I got you. Give and go. Shot blocked from behind. Put back up by Sharan Good. So Bobo gets blocked from behind. Sharan cleans up the garbage. 4.49 to go in the half. Tullahoma leads 12-4 on the Light Tube Sports Network. Tullahoma in the white. Marshall County is in blue. 4.49 to go in the first half. Tullahoma leads 12-4. Lady Cats defense has been remarkable. Very pesky. You see the full court pressure. Tullahoma steals it again. This is Sharan. It was smacked away by Bobo. Or by Brent, uh, Duncan. Now North gets the call from Coach Hibden. North, Duncan, Vincent, Sharan, Melton on the floor. Melton with the left hand. Back out front to North. Here's Melton again. Travel called once again on the first step to begin the dribble. As a referee, you know, I guess you just are either going to let people do that or not. These guys are not. Halfway through the second quarter, Telehoma on top by eight. Vincent, good defense in the backcourt. Stepped away by Melton. Saved by Melton. Melton drives, layup, no good, rebound Ridley. Ridley drives in, shot, no good, rebound Lily Melton. North, little cross step, good. 3.20 to go in the half. Tullahoma by 10. You're watching Wildcat Basketball on the Light Tube Sports Network. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. 
Telehoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of light tube reliability. Is Telahoma has outscored Marshall County 7-2 to two here in the second quarter. Telahoma also outscored the Tigerettes 7-2 to two in the first quarter. That gives us our 14-4 score with 3.15 to go in the half. Marshall County's Ridley. To Steely. And they didn't call it that time. See, I don't understand the inconsistency. Pass in the post and a foul by Faith Vincent, Telahoma. The Lady Cats' third team foul and the first on Vincent. Marshall County will inbound baseline as they get Ridley, Jashelle Ridley, back in. So I guess number one, number 35, sisters or cousins or something. Stolen away by Telahoma's Vincent. Here's North. North circles around. North. And then they call it. So, Telehomas is going to have to dribble first and then take that step. Both teams are. Because they're not used to this being called. It, it's kind of unusual now in basketball for, the, for that to be called. They pretty much give them that step. Most games, even high school games and junior high games. But not tonight. 2.25 to go in the half. Marshall County three-pointers, good. That's Ridley. No, Steely who connects. And the lead is cut to 14-7 with 2.15 to go. Telahoma's running number five. That sets Duncan up to kick to Vincent for three. Bottom. Faith Vincent gets on the scoreboard tonight with a big three-pointer. And with 90 seconds to play in the half, Telahoma back on top by 10. Ridley to Ridley. Good. That should happen about 10, 15 times a game, I would think. 70 seconds left. Lady Cats by eight. Melton drives in. Left hand shot, no good. Grabs her own rebound. Puts it back up, no good. Rebound, Marshall County. Tigerettes want to run, but they don't have the numbers. Steely, three-point try, short, no good. May have been tipped. If so, nobody is confessing. Telahoma will have possession with 47 seconds left. And Madeline Lidstrom, a freshman guard, will enter for Telahoma. So one, two, three freshmen and two seniors on the floor for the Lady Cats. Significantly different rotation than we saw in mid-December when we were last here. I think for the Coffee County game. Melton for three, too strong. Rebound Marshall County, 20 seconds left to go in the half. And the, lady, the Tigerettes throw it away, Ridley looking inside there for Thomason, threw it over her head. 
15.3 left to go for Tullahoma with an eight-point lead. Five seconds left. Marshall County slaps it out of bounds. And Coach Hibden's going to get back in some offensive firepower here with Bobo Lidstrom. That's Isabella and Aubrey North. Four and a half seconds to go. Clock starts now. Bobo, out of time, got to shoot. Too long, waited too long. The foul will not be called. We've played half here at the Cat Palace, and the Tullahoma Lady Cats lead Marshall County 17 to nine. We'll put the camera at midcourt for the half. We'll see you for the second half. You're watching Tullahoma High School Basketball on the Light Tube Sports Network. Ag hurting your gaming. Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA Light Tube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA Light Tube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, Light Tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with Light2. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from Light2 uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455 4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? 
are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA Light Tube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA Light Tube Customer Service at 455 4515. Well, Light Tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like two. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like two uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, LightTube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with Light2. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from Light2 uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, 
LightTube Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add LightTube Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Welcome back to Tullahoma High School as we are set to begin the third quarter of tonight's first game, the District 8 AAA opener between the Lady Cats and the Marshall County Tigerettes. Tullahoma leads 17 to nine. Lady Cats are in white home uniforms, Marshall County in the blue. And we are set to go with the second half here. Marshall County 11 and one on the season. Telahoma six and nine. And again, this is the District 8 AAA opener. Everybody wants to get off to a good start in district play. So far, Telahoma has. Ridley releases a three, rebound by Sharan. Emily with solid minutes tonight. On the floor for Tullahoma North, Vincent, Lidstrom, Melton, and Sharan. Tullahoma going big. Melton for three, a little short. Rebounded by Ridley. Yeah, this is a big lineup for Tullahoma. Rebound, Lidstrom. You have Melton, Lidstrom, and Sharan all, what, six feet, close to six feet, 5'10", 5'11". And then Vincent and North. Melton, the leading scorer tonight so far for Tullahoma. Vincent drives in the paint. Foul called on the floor before the shot. First team foul on Marshall County. And that goes on Maggie Steely, her first. Now Bobo in for Sharan. Tullahoma's North will inbound. Lidstrom drives hard. Left hand layup, no good. Rebound Marshall County. Tiger Heads take it inside with Ridley, blocked, gets the rebound, shot no good. And Bobo comes away with it for the Lady Cats. Bobo off her foot, saves it to North. Wide open three, no good. Rebound, Lidstrom put back, no good. Melton with the rebound, tried to dribble it. Got slapped away and now a jump ball possession with the arrow pointing toward the Tullahoma Lady Cats. 5.50 to go, third quarter. Tullahoma leads by eight. Small crowd here at the Cat Palace tonight, really considering that Lewisburg's a pretty good trip and it is a nasty night. It's really not that bad of a crowd, I guess. I probably didn't expect this many. Vincent for three, no good. Lidstrom with a rebound. Put back, no good, Lidstrom. And again, we have a alternate possession. This time, it will go to Marshall County. So, good battles under the boards. Tullahoma unable to hit there. Missed multiple opportunities to score. And the lead is still eight.
Ridley to Ridley. Ridley just drives right down the lane, misses the layup. No foul. Telehoma's north to Lidstrom. Lidstrom for three, no. Rebound chased down by Vincent for Telehoma. Melton in the paint with the left hand, good. Beautiful left-handed drive by Lily Melton. And with 4.45 to go in the third quarter, Telehoma back up by 10. Melton more aggressive offensively than I've seen her recently. Stolen away by Bobo. Bobo for the uncontested layup, good. Marshall County needs a timeout. 4.26 to go in the third. Telehoma's biggest lead of the night, 12 points on the Light Tube Sports Network. Did you know that Telehoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Telehoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Telehoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of light tube reliability. Telehoma with a nice little offensive spurt here. Last couple of minutes, increase its lead to 21 to nine over Marshall County. 426 to play in the third quarter. Telehoma's defense has been smothering. Stolen away by Lidstrom. Lidstrom to the hole, layup. No good, rebound Lidstrom. Kicks it out to Bobo for three, no. North with the rebound. Melton, back to North for three. Give it to her. Wow, great offensive rebound by the Lady Cats. And that leads to multiple opportunities and North connects. 15 point lead for the Lady Cats, 345 to go in the third. Coach Steely a bit frustrated on the Marshall County bench. His team has not really played very well. Somebody goes down in the paint. Kind of a late whistle there if the call was took place there. I guess so. Foul on Bobo, that's her first, Telehoma's first team foul here in the third quarter. Tigerettes unable to penetrate this Telehoma defense. Ridley to Ridley, blocked by Melton. Gets it to Bobo, great block by Lily Melton. Just kept her good position, good footwork. 3.05 to go in the third, Telehoma by 15. I'll tell you, in high school basketball with no shot clock, if I had a 15 point lead, 
I wouldn't shoot again. I would make the other team come way out and play me, and eventually they're going to have to foul you. If you can handle the ball well enough, that's the problem. North, wide open three, bottom. Aubrey North heating up here with back-to-back -back threes with 2.30 to go. Tullahoma's up by 18 points. And we'll get a foul on the Lady Cats. Last thing Tullahoma wants to do at this point is stop the clock. Melton with her first. Second team foul on Tullahoma. Sharan and Duncan back in for the Lady Cats. So Tullahoma goes from maybe its biggest, tallest lineup to a much smaller lineup. Spinning in the paint, shot up no good, rebound Bobo. Marshall County just cannot shoot well tonight. This team's 11 and one, I looked through their schedule, they beat some good teams. It's not like they built an 11 and one record on a bunch of cupcakes. Maybe one or two cupcakes, but not a bunch. What do you call a bunch of cupcakes? Lunch. 135 to go in the third quarter. Tullahoma by 18. And they are doing just what I would do. Killing some clock. I like it. Got that smaller, quicker lineup in there. Maybe a little better ball handling. We're down to 110 to go in the third. Sharan may have got away with a walk right there. Bobo, little head fake, goes around the screen, pulls it back out front. In the corner, Sharan. Under a minute to go in the third quarter now. Is Tullahoma going to use the final three minutes of this quarter with an 18-point lead? If I'm Marshall County, I'm committing a foul or something to stop this. North in the corner to Bobo. Bobo in the paint. Puts up kind of a wild shot, but drew the foul. And McLean Bobo will shoot two with 34 seconds to go. That is great clock management, in my opinion, with an 18-point lead. They used pretty much the second half of the third quarter just on that possession and finish it off and pay it off with McLean Bobo at the line, sinking her first free throw. Second one bounces out. Marshall County got away with a the travel there. Inside Ridley, no good. Put back by Ridley, good. And the Tigerettes are finally in double digits. Five seconds to go in the third quarter. North kicks it to Bobo. Need a shot up. Bobo spins, puts it up, no good. Rebound Sharan. The third quarter is over. Tullahoma leads 28 to 11 on the Light Tube Sports Network. Lag hurting your gaming. Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube customer service at 455-4515. Well, LightTube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like to Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like to uh, as far as 
uh, internet connectivity. Tullahoma outscored Marshall County 11 to 2 in the third quarter to build a 28-11 lead with eight minutes to play here. Again, Marshall County 11 and 1 on the year. Tullahoma 6 and 9. District 8 AAA opener for both teams. Melton, soft shot up, no good. Rebound Tigerettes. And yes, they are still the Tigerettes. Ridley for three. No good. Rebound chased down by Lidstrom. Bobo, beautiful ball fake, layup good. And a foul is called. So Bobo. Gets the and one. It's a little nice little head fake there. Just totally fooled the defender. Tullahoma up by 19. McLean Bobo trying to add one and convert the old-fashioned three-point play. Free throws good. Tullahoma leads by 20. 7.15 to go. I've always found it interesting that the Tullahoma crowd struggles to cheer for the Lady Cats. I don't really understand it. Tullahoma commits a foul down low. Foul is on Vincent, her second first team foul on Tullahoma. But I mean, with this big lead over a team that's 11 and 1, fourth quarter. You would think uh, the crowd would be making some noise, but uh, not much. 6.50 to go. Lady Cats by 18. Of course, that is the nature of sort of stalling and pulling out the offense, as they say, is that uh, it doesn't give you much to cheer about. Melton for three, though, too strong off the back of the iron. Saved by Ridley. Ridley will take it all the way. Left hand, no good. She's missed multiple layups. Just throws it up there. See if Telehomo let the air back out. As we cross the six-minute mark here in the fourth quarter, Lady Cats by 18, trying to get the a win here in the district opener. Kind of the rule is you got to win your, your district home games, right? That's, that's where you start. You want to win your home games. Then hope to get some of those road games. Melton, little dribble drive kick. Five and a half minutes to go. It also doesn't, when you uh, pull the ball out like this, it doesn't provide lots of uh, opportunities for the play-by-play -play guy to pull out adjectives, descriptive adjectives, and to make it all flowery and everything. You're just passing the ball back and forth. So we watch. Five minutes to go. Tullahoma calls a timeout. It's a five-minute mark. The Lady Cats lead at 31-13 on the Light Tube Sports Network.
never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month along with your digital television service, like to Cloud DVR lets you record up to 8 programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage and whole home DVR. Call TUA customer service to add light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Telehoma will inbound from the far sideline, midcourt, with Lidstrom, North, Duncan, Bobo, and Sharan on the floor. Tried to get it inside to Sharan, just a little bit high. Marshall County gets the steal with four and a half minutes to play. Tigerettes need offense, and they need it now. That was a little bit of a walk. Two-point tries, no good. Rebound, Lidstrom, Tullahoma. Bobo all the way in the lane and block called against Marshall County. I think McLean pretty fortunate right there. That foul is on Blackman, her third, second team foul on the Tigerettes. Vincent back in. Ball comes to Lidstrom. Now to North, open from 12 feet away, good. Aubrey North, I think eight, maybe 10 points tonight for North. Tullahoma's lead is back to 20, 3.50 to go. Foul from behind there by Lidstrom. For Isabella, I think that's her fourth, and it is. Second team foul on Tullahoma. And Melton will come in for North. Lidstrom will stay on the floor with four fouls. So Tullahoma back with a big lineup now with Melton, Sharan, and Lidstrom. Good job by Lidstrom not to foul. Really the point the points aren't as important as keeping the clock going right now. When you're up by 20, three and a half to go in the fourth quarter, just keep the clock running. If they get a basket, they get a basket. Turnover, Lady Cats, as it's tipped by Marshall County and then tipped again by Melton before it went out of bounds. Marshall County, not much urgency considering the deficit. As I say that, Ridley just throws up a three and it's good. So Tullahoma's lead cut to 15 with three minutes to go. Melton from 15 off the backboard, no good. Rebound scrambled for. Foul called on Tullahoma. Foul is on Sharan, her first. Third team foul on the Lady Cats, leading by 15 with 2.38 to go. Tullahoma gets that smaller, quicker lineup back in with North and Duncan, Vincent, Melton, Sharan. Oh 
Well, Ridley giving them their offense right now and doing a pretty good job of it. They've cut a 20-point lead to 13 with 2.05 to go. Vincent. See if Tillahoma can use some more of this clock. Sharan Duncan for three, missed every. I got a piece of the rim, but the fight for the rebound in there. The alternate possession goes to Marshall County. And Madeline Lidstrom back in for Tullahoma. 140 to go, 13 point lead for the Lady Cats. See if they can close this one out. There's a bump foul on Vincent against Ridley. And that's Tullahoma's fourth team foul. So Marshall County is in the bonus the rest of the way. 135 to go. Tullahoma needs a stop and a score to put this one away. Layup inside, good by Marshall County. The lead is 11 with 120 to go. Marshall County needs to start fouling. They've only got two team fouls. One minute left to play here. The Lady Cats on top by 11. North. Free lane to the basket, good. Timeout on the court, 53 seconds to go. We'll be back on the Light Tube Sports Network. Fifty-three seconds to play here. Tullahoma trying to close out Marshall County and win the first District 8 AAA game of the season. Good job by Melton. Stolen away by Vincent. Forty seconds to go. Just a game of keep away now. North. Marshall County doesn't have enough fouls to really get to fouling. They may foul, but it's not going to put Tullahoma at the line. 20 seconds left. Melton, Euro step, shot blocked away. Tullahoma will retain possession with 18.6 left to go. Tullahoma's number 10, Harper McShea, freshman guard, gets in. Little live game action. Number 25, Lily Morris, freshman forward. So Coach Hibden, bunch of freshmen on the floor right now to close out Marshall County and win the district opener. Backdoor cut, shot blocked by Marshall County. Tullahoma will maintain possession. McShay tried to take it to the hole. Get on the scoreboard. Five and a half seconds to go. Duncan. Just hold the ball. Tullahoma starts out District 8 AAA play with a victory. The Lady Cats beat the Marshall County Tigerettes 35 to 22. Tullahoma now eight and nine, seven and nine on the season. And Marshall County falls to 11 and two. Tullahoma one and zero oh in District 8 AAA play. Stick around. We'll have our boys game in about 15 minutes. Again, our final, 
in the girls' contest. Tullahoma 35, Marshall County 22. You're watching Tullahoma High School Sports on the Light Tube Sports Network. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of light tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA Light Tube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA Light Tube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, Light Tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with Light2. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from Light2 uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage and whole home DVR. Call TUA customer service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? 
TUA Light Tube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA Light Tube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, Light Tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like to businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like to uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, LightTube Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add LightTube Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know the Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, LightTube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like to businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like to uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, LightTube 
iCloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, LightTube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like to Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like to uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Welcome to Tullahoma High School in this broadcast of the Light Tube Sports Network. Tonight, 
The Tullahoma Wildcats and the Marshall County Tigers open District 8 AAA play. Starting lineup for Marshall County, number zero, Marcus O'Neill. Number two, Asia Jones. Number five, Xavier Mosley. Number 14, Jabray Howard. And number 24, Jamal Gentry. The Tigers are coached by LaVon King, former coach at Moore County. Now the starting lineup for your Wildcats. Number zero, junior DeAndre Jenkins. Number three, sophomore Alex Bobo. Number 22, junior sharpshooter Keegan Taylor. Number 23, senior Jaden Sanchez. And number 33 is Xavier Farrell, the junior. Tullahoma coached by Jason Welch, assisted by Nick Watson, A.J. Johnson, Dale Alsup, and Jonathan Wood. Marshall County is 9-5 overall. Their last game, a 73-69 win over Lead Academy. Tullahoma comes in at eight and six. The Wildcats are in white. The Tigers are in black. Bobo for three, good. So Alex Bobo opens the scoring here. Tullahoma full court pressure stolen by Jenkins. Jenkins layup, good. Marshall County beats the press this time. Drives to the basket. Layup no good, chased down by the by the Tigers, and then I think Jenkins may have fouled. DeAndre Jenkins with the early foul, his first. Tullahoma jumps out 5-0. Got the quick steal on defense. And the layup. After Bobo hit a three-pointer. Marshall County's number 14, Howard. Averages 18 points a game. There's a drive in the paint. Shot no good by O'Neill. But he's fouled. And O'Neill will shoot two for the Tigers. Foul is on Bobo, his first. Marcus O'Neill. Again, Howard averages 18 points and six rebounds a game. Gentry, number 24, averages 12 points, three and a half assists per game. Second free throw, no good. Rebound, Tullahoma. Here's Farrell, quickly, to the top of the key. Inside to Sanchez, shot up, no good. Rebound, Tigers. Seven minutes to go, first quarter. Marshall County, fast break, layup, good. That was Jones. He averages 10 points a game. O'Neal, uh, O'Neal. DeAndre Jenkins with a shot up, no good. We got an alternate possession. First one belongs to Marshall County. Cats lead at 5-3, 6.46 to go here in the first quarter. Tullahoma's full court pressure. Foul called on Jenkins, and that's two early ones on DeAndre. Tullahoma with three team fouls. And in for the Cats, number 11, Kanai Johnson. Marshall County running their stuff. Tullahoma in man-to-man defense. Now a little, maybe a little zone action.
Cats making it tough for the Tigers to get off a shot here. And Marshall County will pull it back out. Initiate the offense. Drive and kick. Tullahoma recovers defensively. Left hand shot up good. Nice move by O'Neill. We're tied at five with 5.35 to go in the first quarter. Taylor inside Sanchez layup good. Beautiful pass by Keegan Taylor. Jaden Sanchez with the bucket. Slapped away by Tullahoma. Saved by Taylor. Taylor kicks to Farrell. Wildcats inside Sanchez again. Sanchez layup good. And that gentleman was fouled. Jaden Sanchez with a strong offensive move sinks the bucket. He'll shoot one. District 8 AAA opener. Sanchez give it to him. Cats lead it 10-5, 5-10 to go in the first quarter. Continued full court pressure. Marshall County breaks it. In the corner for three. Good. Well, that's Howard, and he's a scorer. So no surprise there. Three-point try is no good. Tigers with the rebound. Fast break opportunity layup good. Mosley scores for the Tigers. Just like that, we're tied at 10 with 4.30 to go in the first quarter. Bobo to Johnson. Taylor it tries to go inside Sanchez. Slapped away, saved by Taylor. Back out front to Bobo. Xavier Farrell for three. No good. Rebound scrambled for, saved by Marshall County. Tigers trying to take their first lead of the night. Drive to the basket, beautiful move, layup no good, but a foul on Tullahoma. That was Howard, Jabray Howard. Kanai Johnson picks up his first personal foul. It's four team fouls on Tullahoma. Marshall County will be in the bonus the rest of the way. Free throw is good. Tigers lead for the first time. Steverson in for the Wildcats, number 15. And number two, Malik Grizzard in for Tullahoma, also number 12. Austin Tennant, Bobo for three, no good. Rebound, Howard for the Tigers. Boy, he's athletic. Howard just throws it up there, fouled before the shot. That's Tullahoma's fifth team foul, so Howard will shoot two. Tigers by one here, 3.36 to go. First quarter, Howard's free throw good. In for Tullahoma, number 32, Lucas Price, sophomore. And timeout on the court. 3.36 to go in the first. Marshall County by two on the Light Tube Sports Network. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Bray Howard will shoot his second free throw for Marshall County. 
after the timeout. Tenon, Steverson, Johnson, Grizzard, and Price on the floor for the Wildcats. Second free throw, no good. Rebound, Kanai Johnson. Got a foul down low as Tenon being held. That'll go against A.J. Jones, his second, and Marshall County's second. Grizzard for the Wildcats to Price. Johnson opening. Johnson lays it off the glass. No good. Rebound Tenon put back good. Austin Tenham with his first bucket tonight. Marshall County fast break, though. Scores the bucket and draws the foul on Tenham. Tigers got back a whole lot faster than the Wildcats did. At the line is Jones. Tenham's first. Marshall County looks to be a little quicker than the Wildcats. Steverson back out front to Johnson. Three minutes to go, first quarter. Marshall County on top by three. Tenon Johnson pulls up from 10 feet away, give it to him. Kanai Johnson pulls the Cats within one with 2.40 to go in the first. Crossover step, clay up, good. What a move. Jace Harney with a bucket. Malik Grizzard. There's a foul called on the floor. I think that will go against Tullahoma. No. Third team foul on Marshall County. That's uh, on Mosley, his first. Malik Grizzard will shoot two at the line for the Wildcats. A lot of free throws early in this one. Grizzard sinks it. Taylor back in for the Cats, replacing Price. And Malik. Try to pull the Cats within one. And he does. Two twenty left to go, first quarter. One point game. Three pointer from deep in the corner, no good. Rebound Bryson Stevenson. Johnson to Taylor. Inside, Tenon lost control. Here's Howard. Howard, beautiful bounce pass, layup blocked by Johnson. Second layup good. Well, nice block by Kanai Johnson, but Marshall County followed it up with a bucket. 135 to go in the first. Foul out front on the Tigers. I think that's on 11, Markel Harris. It's the fourth team foul on Marshall County. Harris is first. And Tullahoma will inbound baseline with Taylor. Malik Grizzard with a three-pointer is good. Grizzard drills the three. We're tied at 19. 120 left to go in the first. Exciting first quarter here. A lot of scoring action. Three-point try. Good. Marshall County's sinks the three. That's Harris. The Tigers back up by three. Taylor inside to Steverson.
Steverson, strong move inside, no good. Rebound, Steverson, blocked away. Marshall County comes away with it. Beautiful pass, slip, blocked by Johnson, his second block of the night. Howard kicks it to nobody, saved by Marshall County, and then saved by Bryson Steverson. 20 seconds to go, first quarter. Johnson with 12 seconds on the clock. Telehoma down by three. Tenon pulls up from 10 feet away. No good. Rebound Marshall County. Five seconds to go. Quickly the other way. Pull up for three. In and out. No good. And the first quarter is over. Whew. Hectic pace. Marshall County leads 22-19 on the Light Tube Sports Network. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA Light Tube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA Light Tube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, Light Tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like two. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like two uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Set to begin the second quarter here with Marshall County leading Telehoma 22 to 19. On this nasty January night, appreciate you tuning in to the Light Tube Sports Network. Our producer, camera operators, Clay Turner. My name's Scott Shastine. Telehoma inside. Jalen Thompson shot blocked, but the second time Thompson's foul. Jaden will shoot two for the Wildcats. First team foul on Marshall County. Second personal foul on Markel Harris. Thompson. Too strong. Thompson's second free throw is good. Telehoma down by two here early in the second quarter. Stolen away by the Wildcats. Johnson comes away with it. In the corner, Farrell down low to Thompson. Thompson shot up, good. Nice head fake by Jaden. And we're tied at 22 with 7.05 to go in the half. Turn around 10 footer, in and out, no good. Rebound Thompson. Giving Coach Welsh solid minutes here, Jaden Thompson. Backside foul on Marshall County. Now well, maybe that's on Tenon. They were scrapping down low, and it is on Tenon, his second first team foul on Telehoma. So Marshall County sends Howard to the bench. It's always good for the Wildcats. And Marshall County throws it away. So turnover, Tigers. Cats with possession, a chance to take the lead back. Taylor so far has not gotten off a shot. Farrell spins in the lane, shot no good. Rebound, Tigers, quickly. They always want to run. 
Three-point try, no good. Rebound Johnson, he's hit over the back. That is Mosley. His second personal foul. Second team foul on the Tigers. Taylor on the left wing. Looking inside for Johnson, for uh, Thompson. Taylor with the three. In and out, no good. Rebound, Marshall County. Still tied with 5.45 to go in the half. Stolen away, Kanai Johnson. Johnson wants to take it himself for the jam. Kanai Johnson, all 5'11 of him, stuffs it home. Tullahoma leads by two. Pass goes off of Sanchez, so Marshall County will retain possession. Howard back in for the Tigers, number 14. Their leading scorer. Nice pass inside, but couldn't handle it. Farrell comes away with it. Xavier to Sanchez, shot up no good. Walt called on Jaden Sanchez. Everybody takes those two steps now. But that's kind of what we said in the girls game when they called palming. And a bunch of traveling on the drop step. Under five minutes to play in the half. Telehoma by two. Three-pointer dropped in there good. O'Neal with his second three. And the Tigers back up by one. Back and forth we go. Inside Farrell, out of bounds on Telehoma. Farrell tried to back it in. I think it went off his leg or his knee or his foot. 4.25 to go in the half. Marshall County by one. Howard shot blocked by Sanchez. Marshall County retains possession. Three-point try, no good. Rebound chased down by Johnson. Kanai to Taylor. Taylor pulls up for three, no good. Rebound Farrell. Johnson, he'll try a three. Too strong. Rebound Tigers. Foul on the backside by Jaden Sanchez. For Sanchez, that's his first. Second team foul on the Wildcats here in the second quarter with 3.52 to go. Alex Bobo and DeAndre Jenkins back in for the Cats in the front court. I guess that's the back court. 12-footer, no good. Rebound Farrell to Bobo. Open, Jenkins, 4-3, no good. Rebound, Tigers. This is Howard. Three-point try, good. Tyler Thompson hits the three for Marshall County. And with 3.10 to go in the half, Tullahoma trails by four. And the Tigers steal it away. Crossover shot, good. A beautiful step by Marshall County's Gentry. We've got a timeout. 3.03 to go in the half. Marshall County up by six on the Light Tube Sports Network.
Marshall County is coached by former Moore County head coach LaVon King. The Tigers lead the Wildcats 30 to 24, 255 to go in the half. Jenkins out front to Bobo. Now Tenon. Farrell drives Farrell, lays it off the glass. Good. Great move by Xavier Farrell. The lead is four for the Tigers. Shot up, blocked by Farrell, and then he gets the rebound and has it stolen away. Shot up, no good, Tullahoma fouls. Good, quick defense by Marshall County. Has given them this four-point lead and will send Camaria and Allen to the free throw line. Small student section for the Wildcats tonight. It's just a nasty, nasty night to be out. Second free throw for Marshall County. No good. Rebound Tenon. Tenon hits the floor. So a foul on the Tigers. That's their third team foul. And it will go on O'Neill, his first. Grizzard back in, replacing Farrell. So it's Jenkins, Johnson, Steverson, Grizzard, and Tenon. Stolen away by Marshall County. Stolen back by Grizzard. 12-footer, bottom. Malik Grizzard pulls Telahoma within two. 2.10 to go in the half. Grizzard really providing an offensive spark for the Cats. Jenkins in the lane, six-footer, no good. Rebound Marshall County. He threw it away. 1.51 to go in the half. Tigers by two. Tullahoma with possession. Kanai Johnson crosses the timeline for the Wildcats. Jenkins tried to get it down low to Tenon. Tenon was not looking. Jenkins originally pulled up for the three-point shot. I think saw Tenon streaking down the lane. Unfortunately, Tenon was not looking towards Johnson. Telahoma retains possession, though. Grizzard to inbound from the baseline. Oh, beautiful pass, Bryson Steverson. Layup good, what a pass. 90 seconds to go in the half. We are tied at 30. Telahoma on a 6-0 run. Three-point try, missed this time by O'Neill. Rebound, Tenon. Jenkins works off the pick. Now the double team gets it to Tenon, to Grizzard for three. No good. Rebound chased down Marshall County. 45 seconds to go in the half. Tried to get it down low, stolen by Telahoma. Steverson gets it to Johnson. In the corner, Grizzard. Thirty seconds to go in the half. Tullahoma can play for one shot. No shot clock. High school basketball. They can stand there until Marshall County defends, which they do. Fifteen seconds to go in the first half. Jenkins, no crossover. Jenkins drives in. Floater's no good, but he's fouled on the floor before the shot. That will be Marshall County's fourth team foul. foul. 
And Sanchez, Taylor, and Farrell back in for Tenon, Steverson, and Jenkins. Taylor to inbound. Johnson back to Taylor. Inside Sanchez. Turn around, six footer, no good. Tip good. Xavier Farrell gives Telehoma the lead at halftime with a late bucket. The Wildcats lead the Tigers 32 to 30. Stay here for the exciting second half on the Light Tube Sports Network. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, Light Tube Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light Tube Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Telehoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455 4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, LightTube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like two. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like two uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515.
Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube Customer Service at 455-4515. Well, LightTube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with like to businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like to uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month along with your digital television service, Light to Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light to Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is lag hurting your gaming? Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube Customer Service at 455-4515.
Welcome back to Tullahoma High School. The gym on Jackson Street. The Cat Palace. Tullahoma Wildcats lead the Marshall County Tigers 32 to 30 as we begin this third quarter. Tullahoma with a bucket at the buzzer to take this lead. It has just been back and forth, back and forth all game long. Marshall County led 22 to 19 at the end of the first quarter, so Tullahoma outscored the Tigers 13 to eight in the second quarter. Marshall County in black, Tullahoma in white, and the Wildcats moving left to right here in the second half. Marshall County, excellent ball movement. Tullahoma's defense recovers. Cross court pass leads to a three. That's no good. Rebound taken away by Marshall County. Shot inside, no good, but a foul. Tullahoma's first team foul of the second half. And that is a second foul on Kanai Johnson. So at the line, Xavier Mosley. His free throw is no good. Mosley delivers the second. It's no good. Rebound Marshall County. They've been really good on the offensive boards. Jenkins comes away with it for the Wildcats, though. Tullahoma with its two-point lead. Johnson drives and kicks. Sanchez back out to Jenkins. Jenkins tried to go inside to Sanchez, I think. Really nobody there. Turnover Wildcats. Seven minutes to go in the third quarter. Tullahoma by two. Howard for three, no. Marshall County another offensive rebound. Kicked off Tullahoma's foot though and Marshall County will retain possession. Tigers get it into Howard. He drives into the paint. Surrounded by four Wildcats. Kicks it out for a three. No good. Rebound knocked out of bounds. Tullahoma will have possession. 6.35 to go in the third. Cats by two. Kanai Johnson to DeAndre Jenkins. Inside, Jaden Sanchez layup, no good. And he's called for the travel. Tullahoma in a 1 2 2 zone now. Howard drives and kicks. O'Neill for three. Rebound Farrell. Farrell, outlet pass to Jenkins, too strong. And Tullahoma turns it right back over. 5.50 left to go in the third. Turnover Marshall County. This time Jenkins. Layup good. DeAndre Jenkins gives Tullahoma a four point lead. Three-point try, no good, rebound Howard. Howard's put back good. Tullahoma has held Howard in check for the most part. He's probably got 10 though anyway. 5.15 to go in the third. Cats by two. Taylor for three, no. Taylor gets the rebound, pulls up from the free throw line, no. Rebound Marshall County.
4.45 left in the third quarter. Telahoma by two, great pass inside, blocked by Farrell, but Farrell called for the foul. Telahoma two team fouls, and that is the first on Xavier Farrell. At the line for the Tigers, Xavier Mosley. Mosley's free throw is good. Alex Bobo back in for the Wildcats, replacing Kanai Johnson. And Mosley will try to tie this game up one more time. Nope, rebound Bobo. Clears to Farrell. Taylor for three, wouldn't go. Farrell with the backside rebound, kicks out to Jenkins. 4.20 left to play in the third quarter. Bobo, nice head fake, little floater falls short. Rebound Marshall County. Ten-footer is good for Jones. And the Tigers are back on top by one. 3.45 to go, third quarter. Jenkins making some moves. Now he's stuck. Gets it to Farrell. Jenkins tried to get it to Taylor and threw it away. So turnover Wildcats with 3.29 to go in the third. Marshall County on top by one. The biggest lead of the game has been six points by Marshall County, and that came right before halftime. And that's a carry by O'Neill. So we got a carry call in the girls' game and a carry call in the boys' game. You just don't see them very often. It's not that players don't carry the ball a lot. You just don't see the call anymore. There's a foul 60 feet from the basket by O'Neill. I'm sure Coach King's thrilled with that. First team foul on Marshall County, but third personal foul on Marcus O'Neill. Bobo got trapped, tried to get it to Farrell, knocked out of bounds by Marshall County. Bobo out front, defense is tight. Tenon to Farrell, Farrell down low, shot no good. Tenon with a rebound, put back good. Tullahoma retakes the lead, timeout on the court. 2.55 to go in the third quarter. This is the Light Tube Sports Network. Well, Light Tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Uh, We had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount. Uh, with like to businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from like to uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. remaining in the third quarter. Tullahoma leads Marshall County by one. And the Tigers have possession. This has been a really close game, a well-played game. It's 
slapped away by Jenkins. Bobo recovers, needs some help. Jenkins almost went over and back. Good body control now stolen by the Tigers. Went in for the layup, shot no good. Jenkins with the foul. Prevented a certain layup, so it's not a bad foul. But it is Tullahoma's third team foul. And it is the third personal foul on DeAndre Jenkins. So it looks like Kanai Johnson will come in to replace Jenkins. Free throws no good. Malik Grizzard also in. So Jenkins will stay in. So we've got Grizzard, Johnson, Jenkins, Steverson, and Tenen. Second free throw, no good. Rebound Jenkins to Johnson. 2.25 to go in the third. Grizzard for three, no good. Rebound Marshall County's Howard. Shot inside is good by Jones. Nice pass from Howard. With two minutes to play in the third quarter, Marshall County takes the lead. Jenkins saves it. Jump ball, alternate possession goes to Tullahoma. One forty-six left to go in the third. Johnson working out front. Drives to the paint, spins, eight footer, no good. Rebound, Steverson knocked away. Ball goes out of bounds, Telehoma will retain possession. Tell you why, you knock Bryson Steverson away. He's thick. 133 to go in the third. Grizzard, Jenkins. Johnson tried to get it inside to Tenon, stolen away by Marshall County. Tigers with a one point lead. 70 seconds to go in the quarter, blocked by Tenon. Steverson comes away with it. One minute to go in the quarter. Steverson down low, kicks out to Jenkins. Jenkins drives, layup, no good. Tenon with the rebound, put back, no good. Jenkins with the rebound, put back, no good. Rebound Howard for Marshall County. 45 seconds to go, long pass, layup good. Marshall County has multiple fast break points tonight. Tullahoma not getting back on defense. Cats down by three. Grizzard, no good. Rebound, chase down. Marshall County saves it. And the layup, no good. Rebound, DeAndre Jenkins. 20 seconds to go in the quarter. Tigers by three. Now 12 seconds. Long three-pointer by Jenkins, no good. Rebound, Tenon, good. Off the glass as the third quarter comes to a close. Marshall County leads Tullahoma 39-38 on the Light Tube Sports Network. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month along with your digital television service, Light Tube Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage and whole home DVR. Call TUA customer service to add Light Tube Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 445-4515. 
So we begin the fourth quarter with Marshall County leading by a point. Tullahoma in the white, Marshall County in the black. This is the District 8 AAA opener for both teams. Everybody wants to get started on a positive note in district play. The Wildcats trying to do that tonight. Long three-point try, no good. Rebound Malik Grizzard, but he stepped on the baseline. What are we waiting on? Marshall County, inbounds baseline. Howard has it stolen away by Tullahoma's Jaden Thompson. Johnson, Taylor. Tennant has a huge size advantage. They could just get it to him down low. Cats, good ball control. Tenon down low, Thompson. Shot up, no good. Thompson has it taken away by Howard. Jabray Howard drives all the way on Tenon layup. Good, and he's fouled. Well, Jabray Howard averages 18 points a game for Marshall County. That gives you a little peek into why right there. Body control. Drawing the foul, making the bucket. Bobo back in for the Wildcats. Howard to shoot one. Free throw, no good. Rebound, Tenon. Tigers by three, 6.45 to go. Taylor for three, bottom. Keegan Taylor gets on the board, and we're tied at 41. Foul on Tullahoma. I think that is Bobo. And it is the fourth personal foul on Alex Bobo. So he'll take a seat. DeAndre Jenkins back in for the Wildcats. Two team fouls on Tullahoma. Marshall County has it slapped away, but saved by Howard for three. No good. Saved by the Tigers. Down low, Howard shot. No good, but he's fouled. Howard so quick down there. Third team foul on Tullahoma. And that's the fourth personal foul on Tenon. Sanchez back in for the Wildcats along with Farrell. Taylor, Jenkins, Thompson. Jabray Howard at the line for Marshall County. Free throw is good. The Tigers lead by one with 6.22 to go. Taylor drives to the rack, layup no good, but he's fouled. Well, you don't see Keegan drive to the hole very often, but he did it that time with authority. Drew the foul and will shoot two. First team foul on Marshall County. First personal foul on Gentry. Taylor's free throw good. We're tied at 42. Second one, give it to him. 
Keegan Taylor sinks them both. Tullahoma leads by one. Rebound Thompson for the Wildcats. Five forty-five to go. Down low, tried to get it to Thompson. Out of bounds. Give it. Uh, Tullahoma will have possession. Taylor to inbound baseline. Farrell drives. Farrell layup, no good. But before the shot, Farrell is fouled. So Tullahoma will inbound baseline. Second team foul on Marshall County. First personal foul on Jones. Cats by one, five and a half minutes to play. Farrell spins, shot up, no good, but he's fouled. Xavier Farrell showing great quickness in the lane. He will shoot two. Farrell's free throw short. Second free throw for Xavier. In and out, no good. Rebound Howard. Howard, bounce pass, layup good. That's how you run the fast break right there. Marshall County by a point. Back and forth we go. 5.05 to play. Taylor, working. Taylor finds himself 15 feet away. Good. Cats back on top. Taylor sinks the bucket. 4.50 to go. O'Neal, underhand scoop, what a move by O'Neal. Marshall County back on top. I bet we've had 20 lead changes. 4.20 to go. Taylor for three, bottom, off the backboard. Somebody call Bank. 4.14 to go, Cats by two on the Light Tube Sports Network. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515 to gain the reassurance of Light Tube reliability. Is Tullahoma's cheerleaders showing off their significant gymnastics abilities. And during the break, 4.05 left to play here. Tullahoma leads Marshall County by two. There's a foul on Taylor. Good job by Marshall County's Jones of drawing that contact. Tigers will throw it in baseline. That's four. Team fouls on Tullahoma. Marshall County's in the bonus the rest of the way. That's a long time, four minutes. Yeah. 
Tigers have three team fouls. Howard, good, off the glass. We're tied at 48, 340 to go. Taylor for three, no good. Rebound Tigers. Farrell tries to get the steal, but it will go Marshall County's way. 3.28 to go. We're tied at 48. This crowd is into it now. Marshall County shot, no good. Rebound Farrell for the Wildcats. 250 left, Tullahoma by, well, we're tied. Turnover, Wildcats. Tigers on the fast break, layup good. Timeout, Marshall County. 2.29 to go. Tigers by three. Bag hurting your gaming. Tips. Is a weak signal stalling your social media posts? Are constant updates slowing down your productivity? TUA LightTube has a solution. Enroll in our mesh router service starting at $9.95 a month. With the ability to cover your home with increased signal strength, you can increase productivity and whole home happiness. Start winning today by calling TUA LightTube customer service at 455-4515. Well Two twenty-nine remaining here in this basketball game. District A Triple A opener for both teams. Two twenty-nine remaining. Marshall County leads Tullahoma fifty to forty-eight. Cats inbound it to Taylor. Taylor trapped. And I guess a foul is called. Wow. There's a break for the Cats right there because that gives Marshall County four team fouls. Now both teams are in the bonus for the rest of the way. Tigers by two. Seems to be confusion of some sort. Guess they were just ensuring that that was four fouls and not five. So both teams in the bonus from here on out, 225 to go, or as they say, a deuce and a quarter. Tullahoma trying to tie it up or take the lead. Farrell drives to the paint, layup good. We're tied at 50. O'Neal for the Tigers. Foul out front on DeAndre Jenkins. Didn't see much contact there. But Marshall County's gonna shoot two free throws. For Jenkins, that's his fourth personal foul. At the line for the Tigers is Jace Harney. First one is good. Harney's second one, good. And we have an official's timeout now for some reason. Marshall County by two, 158 to go. And it's a timeout on the floor. 
No, I didn't think so. I don't know what that was. Can we resume action here? Telehoma to inbound against pressure. Jenkins, Farrell, Jenkins. Jenkins to Taylor, inside Farrell. Xavier off the glass, good. We're tied at 52, 140 left to go. Offensive foul, Marshall County. See who will be shooting for the Wildcats. No, Tullahoma will inbound that that was an off-ball foul. So no shooting on that one. Tied at 52, 90 seconds to play. Trying to go inside to Farrell. Stead cross court to Johnson. DeAndre to Farrell, shot up good. Kanai Johnson with a pass to Xavier Farrell. Tullahoma by two. Marshall County comes right back, layup good. 108 to go, we're tied at 54. Timeout on the court, this is the Light Tube Sports Network. The light tube specifically played into our mission when we separated from our parent company and became an employee stock ownership program. Oh, we had to be disconnected from a large network and exist on our own. We needed relatively high speed connectivity, which we got at about a 200% discount uh, with light tube. Businesses can get beyond what most businesses uh, in the country can get from light tube uh, as far as uh, internet connectivity. Well, this game has everything you would want in a high school basketball game. It has been extremely close the entire way. Tullahoma, Marshall County, tied at 54. The Wildcats throw it away. Tigers, shot up, no good. Rebound, Kanai Johnson, foul on Marshall County. Well, that's going to go against Tullahoma. Foul on Kanai Johnson. All righty. Somebody's shooting two for Marshall County. And it is A.J. Jones. 59 seconds to go. Tied at 54. Jones. Clutch free throw opportunity for Marshall County. First one no good. Jones lines up the second one. No good. Rebound Farrell for the Wildcats. Kicked out of bounds by O'Neill. 57 seconds to go. Marshall County full court pressure. Jenkins to Farrell. Back out front to Kanai Johnson. 45 seconds to play. We're tied at 54. Kicked out of bounds by Marshall County. Tullahoma will inbound side midcourt. Farrell to Taylor. Taylor has it taken away. Marshall County. This is Jones. Shot up no good, but a foul. And the Tigers will shoot two. 34 seconds to go. 
Foul is on Kanai Johnson, his fourth. At the line for the Tigers, Jamal Gentry misses the first. Still tied at 54. Second one, yes. Tigers by one, 34 seconds to go. Taylor to Johnson. Looking down low instead to Taylor for three. Bottom! Keegan Taylor with 22 seconds to play. Timeout on the court. Telahoma by two on the Light Tube Sports Network. Never miss your favorite shows again. For an additional $7 a month, along with your digital television service, Light Tube Cloud DVR lets you record up to eight programs at the same time, receive 500 gigabytes of cloud storage, and whole home DVR. Call TUA Customer Service to add Light Tube Cloud DVR to your digital television service today at 455-4515. Well, I'd say the cheerleading competition has been about like the basketball competition. Close. Tullahoma with a slight edge. We've got 22 seconds to play here. The Wildcats lead Marshall County 57-55. Tigers with the basketball. Tullahoma full court pressure. Grizzard in, Jenkins, Johnson, Farrell, and Tenon. Here's O'Neill. O'Neill, sidestep, shot no good, rebound Tenon. Tenon is fouled and he'll shoot two. 15 seconds to go, Austin Tenon. Headed to the free throw line. been one of the best high school basketball games I've seen in a few years. Just really close the whole way. Tenon missed the first. Tullahoma's lead is two. 15.7 seconds to play. Tenon, no. Rebound, Howard, timeout. Cats by two, 14 seconds left on the Light Tube Sports Network. Did you know that Tullahoma Utilities Authority has a solar farm right here in Tullahoma? For as little as $4 a month, you can support solar energy production and breathe a little easier, knowing you're taking positive action to reduce your carbon footprint. Call 455-4515 today. Tullahoma Utilities Authority Light Tube Fiber Internet offers true gigabit service to our customers. We pride ourselves on speed, but the backbone of that speed is local tech support, unmatched customer service, and professional service technicians. To sign up, call 455-4515. To gain the reassurance of light tube reliability. Is All this basketball has come down to 14 and a half seconds to play. Tullahoma leading Marshall County by two. Tigers with the ball. They must go full court against Tullahoma's pressure. Inbounded to Gentry. Cross-court pass, Howard for three, no. Rebound pulled down by DeAndre Jenkins. And Tullahoma with four seconds to go will be at the free throw line with a two-point lead. Well, 
Well, Howard had the look, didn't fall. Jenkins with a strong rebound. DeAndre can win it right here with these two. First one is good. No fouls for Tullahoma now. Three-point lead. You can't foul a shooter. Jenkins free throw. Bottom. Tullahoma by four. Four seconds to go. Howard throws up a prayer, and this ball game is over. The Tullahoma Wildcats open District 8 AAA play with a 59-55 win over Marshall County. Wrap this one in Cardinal and Black. Tullahoma now 9-6 on the year, 1-0 in district play. Again, your final, the Wildcats 59, the Tigers 55. Thank you for watching the Light Tube Sports Network. For Clay Turner, I'm Scott Shasteen. Be good to each other.